Pensacola State College is kept secure with nine trained officers, cameras placed around the school and mobility. These are just some of the tools their officers use to keep students and faculty safe. 900 to 910. 910 to headquarters. But they picture more. With that camera on me, it gets my point of view, what I'm looking at, my actions. It can uh, also get the actions of other people. Officer Tyler Ferguson wants body cameras on all campus police officers. Nowadays, there's a lot of mistrust or um, you know, accusations with police officers doing their job correctly or not. He says body cameras clear up blurred lines between conflicting stories. In the long run, I believe that that will stop a lot of those allegations. The college's police department will ask the county to give them $11,175 for nine body cameras. Chief of the college's police department, Henry Shira, supports this investment. The guys having the cameras on him will allow me to monitor their how they react to people and also how those people react to them. Funding would come from a grant handed down from the federal government. It's called the Burn Grant. Each year it's divided up between the Escambia County Sheriff's Office, Pensacola Police Department, and some of the county's administrative offices. Yeah, as an administrator, I trust my people implicitly. Uh, this is a form of protection for them because things have changed. 